The Hitmaker. This is a reproduction of a 1958 Fender Strat and it's almost identical. Color, everything, all rusted hardware, the pitted chrome. You know, this is a brand new guitar that they made. Every one of these is on the original Hitmaker. And I'll show you when we match them up with the other one later. That's how they move it. Ah, dope. 1958. So that's the real one. This is the real one. It's ancient. Every little mark. This is identical to the back of the real one. It's not perfect because this part of the neck is completely round, and Niles, the real one, is completely flat. And I'll show you later when we match them up. It's super thin. There's, there's actually like no wood here. And that's that. That's what Fender didn't get right. Fender's got it still really big right here, and that's what needs to be uh, fixed. It sounds great. They, they did. That's what I mean. They did the electronic part of it. It does play, and 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 it's absolutely incredible to the real one. It just doesn't feel right yet. And they just need about eight hours of sanding on this neck, and uh, and I think we'll have it. This guitar has played on more than two billion dollars worth of music. Two billion, not million, billion dollars worth of music from hit records to movie scores. <laughs> I think what I believe in is value. This means everything to me. It's becoming one of the most noticed, noticeable guitars. When people see it, they know it's the hit maker and they know it's Niles' guitar. Everything he's ever written has been on this guitar. Everything. Right. I got snow here too. Hey, I got my own snow, alright? I got my own problem. <laughs> <laughs> All right, me and Bill were in some part of Germany yesterday the other day. Look at the beer. That's the beer. Where? In, uh, I don't know, Frankfurt maybe? I don't know. I, I don't know, but that's where uh, Bill found it. Eat those bad boys. They don't work. Are they too big? They're too big. Oh, for well, what? Hold that for it. Oh no, you're yeah, back. I'd right? love to, but I can't bend that way. Why? Because it hurts. Wish I was 5'4, then I'd be able to walk up there. Back. Let's get him to the Let's get him. Come on, help him out. Help him out. We gotta get out of the way. Yeah, we do. I'll never see you. Hold me right here. Hold me right here. Hold me right here. Hold me right here. Is that the real one? Nope. This be the real one. It's your basic hit maker. And, uh, Kind of cool, right? You're gonna have one, you gotta have two. Why? Well, you don't want to be without one. If you have to have two, you might as well be the same. <laughs> Sometimes he can't tell the difference, <laughs> but I won't tell him that. <laughs> hit maker or not? That's why I was trying to get him out of there to give him a few minutes. Really? Nope. I dare you. <laughs> I dare you. <laughs> nah, I can't do that. No way. You can't make me. You can't. Play, play Boston or something. 
He's telling play Boston songs. <laughs> you go to any bar, they still play the same. Exactly. Boston music. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> Born in a feeling. That's great. Can you do dust in the wind? Uh. <laughs> oh, the 80s rock and roll hits, yeah. And he's got a report.